forward to exciting developments are going on in the robotics industry. What lies on the horizon? Join me as I engage in conversations with global industry insiders to venture into the world of robotics and unlock its endless possibilities. In the field, in tune, in depth. This is Sun Sports Light from the 2023 World Robot Conference. The week-long 2023 World Robot Conference wraps up Tuesday in Beijing. Top scientists, entrepreneurs and industry celebrities have been invited as guest speakers, sharing groundbreaking R&D achievements and sparking inspirations among the attendees. China holds great significance in the field of robotics and intelligent manufacturing. As global insiders gather here for the event, we have a great opportunity to gain their valuable insights into the development of the industry and prospects for international cooperation. I wonder what eventually brought you here at the 2023 World Robot Conference. What makes this edition special for you? actually seeing the, the progress that has happened here in, in China. And I'm very impressed with the extra, with the, with the level of, of advancement that I see there, the volumes. I'm very interested in consumer robotics. Robots that come into the home and do simple tasks, which I strongly believe that that's going to be the future. I'd like to know the advancement of robotics in China, and it's amazingly advancing. Every year, everything is changing. This year, I'm impressed by the uh, advancement of medical robots. Now, you can see them as actual product. So there's this shift from a theoretical concept, from a, a lab proof of concept, a lab demonstrator, into something that you can pretty much go and buy and use it, like um, the, the hand uh, exercise, tra hand training robot made with soft robotics. Uh, which was very nice to, to see. There are many uh, good applications uh, for China robot company uh, to implement their idea and product in the industry. You can see that the application robot not only on the ground, as well as able to use underground, sea, sky, as well as space. I think uh, it's almost cover every industry. China has attached great importance to the development of the robotics industry. Cities like Beijing, Shanghai, Shenzhen, Hangzhou and Qingdao and so on, they have developed their own uh, robotics clusters. So how do you view the development and potential of China's robotics industry? I think having developed these clusters is a very, very good step and very important step. I've been pretty much impressed by various applications that you can see and the progress that has been made by companies and the products that they develop. Given that what I've seen, this will be like, there are amazing opportunities and I hope that I will be in contact with some of the companies and hope that I can contribute to their developments as well. For example, Israel does, does have the, the innovation and it can, it can design products it cannot, it doesn't have the manufacturing capabilities. So cooperation is a must. And so China alone, they have a big market here. So uh, I'm, I see the progress. It's very positive, promising. China, this country is uh, very uh, good for, I mean, has a very nice environment for the development of new robots. I mean, there is a lot of opportunities to develop uh, new robots and bring it into the application. Having this opportunity to come to China to, to see the latest development of Chinese robotics was uh, definitely unmissable. I like the fact that uh, Chinese robotics is not just industrial robotics. This is very nice and I appreciate it a lot in the, in the exhibition halls. So the explosion will come from the other markets and I like that China is investing a lot on all these other activities as well. I think that uh, China government uh, did a great job as well as uh, the private enterprises in China. They all have a very good policy and uh, uh, initiative to support the robot industry. I think the robot industry in China is moving in the right track. So I would like to promote the close collaboration between China and ASEAN uh, countries.